What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another episode of Throwback Thursday. And today we are back with that massive eBay box of cards that we picked up a few weeks ago. So this is going to be part two of that box. Uh, we're going to get through as many of them, as much of it as we can. I think this is probably going to be a, probably a four part series because it like if you guys missed the last episode i showed how much it is it is a good size box just cram full of cards everything from hollow rares to reverse hollow rares and comments on comments so but if you guys so we're gonna get into that today but if you guys are new around here please consider hitting that subscribe button we are on the road to 2,000 subscribers and it is always greatly appreciated when a new person subscribes to the channel as well as leave a like on today's video if you do enjoy today's episode but with that being said, we're going to hop in and take a look at some of these cards. Now, these have been from all eras. I've gotten some from Team Rocket and newer. So, maybe we can get lucky and pull some base set cards as well. So, let's see. We got a spoil. Ooh. We got a uh, 2006 card here. That's an older card. Uh, spoink. Another Spoink. Ooh, Reverse Hollow Grumpig from 2008. That's a little bit of an older card. Another grown pig, another grown pig. A lot of it is duplicates and stuff. So, like, we just got a bunch of base set, not base set, uh, Evolutions Nidorans. And then this is from 2007. More Nidorinos from Evolutions. Some 2020 Pokemon cards here. Giraffe Rig. More just bulk cards that's basically all this is on throwback thursday it's just bulk cards taking a look at some of the older cards and everything and working on trying to collect a card from every set you know the well every card basically from every main set that was released the side sets like uh hey we got a rare slow king right here another rare slow king Ooh, rare meloetta that's from 2008. But, like, uh, basically collecting one copy of each card from every set. It's going to take us a very long time. But this is a great way to build your collection up quickly. If you're trying to do that is buy bulk cards like this. I bought this entire box for, like, 80 bucks, I think it was. And came with quite a few cards. We are getting quite a few duplicates. But, ooh, that's pretty cool. That's a Japanese card, I think. Korean card, I'm not sure. Another Japanese card. But there's all kinds of different cool cards in here that I've seen. Mudbray. Another Mudbray. More Mudsprays. But yeah, you definitely, when you do this, you will get a bunch of duplicates. Bunch of, you know, it's going to add a bunch of bulk to you. But at the same time, it is pretty cool to see all of these different cards in one spot. So if you guys enjoy stuff like this, make sure you leave a like on the video so I know that you enjoy these series and I will continue on it. But I also do, like, uh, a couple weeks ago we did a mystery box. I think it was last week. We did an eBay mystery box, a $100 eBay mystery box, which is absolutely amazing. More Japanese cards here. And got some uh, graded cards. That was really cool to see. And I plan on doing more of those mystery boxes when I can. But... Well, oh, that, that, I got sided there for a second. That is uh, Evolutions Mewtwo. Not a base set Mewtwo, unfortunately. More, ooh, we got a Hollow Rare there. So, yeah, you definitely get some decent cards. We got multiple Hollow Rares there. And Reverse Hollow Rares. So, yeah, you definitely get... I feel if I were to break this down and sell it, I definitely would have got my money back. But you just got to be careful. You got to watch and really read the description of what you're getting. Before you just up and decide to buy a bunch of cards. Because sometimes you'll read and it says only commons and uncommons. Sometimes like this one it told me that there would be no ultra rares or stuff like that. So I knew that going in. But I still bought it just because it was still a really good deal. Bunch of EV uh, Evolutions Drowsies there. Don't know what this is from. It's from 2010. We'll put that there. More Drowsies. We got a rare Hypno here. Why not? A couple of them. A couple of Wobbuffets. And this is also good because this is... Honestly, guys, this series is how I managed to do my first couple of giveaways. Where I gave away a bunch of massive cards. Ooh, Hollow Rare Xerneas. That's pretty cool. Galarian Ponytaw. A couple of those. But yeah, this is how I did my giveaways. Uh, a few... The first couple of giveaways here on the channel. That's how I did it in 2008. That card is in really rough condition. Yikes. But it is an older card, so I kind of understand. 
was probably played with with the kid that owned it before this, 2009. And that was not in that rough of condition. But it looks like a little bit of fading, but it could have just been the way the color was printed back then. Scroopy. A couple of Jinx cards here. Another Jinx card from 2010. Uh, more Jinx. Coughings. So, yeah, I just basically... What I do is I will sort these later, put them in my binders, which if you guys want to see how I do that, like how I go, the process of st storing all these cards is, let me know down in the comment section below and I will start working on a video and showing you guys how I handle all of my bulk cards and sorting them and putting them in binders and everything. So, but if, yeah, if it gets enough attention, I will definitely show you guys how I do that, but I'm just kind of trying to keep these all stacked neatly together. Oh, that card is in rough condition as well. Look at that. That is all bent up. Ooh, we got a Stunky from 2008. And then a Stunky from 2020. Reverse Hollow. Corpus. Oh, that's a... Uh... I don't know if this is... It feels weird. This card feels like it's laminated. Yep. Definitely laminated. So this is a fake card. As you guys can tell, it's laminated on there. It felt weird. I felt like that plastic over it. So, and plus when you rip an authentic card, I have a video on how to, on the channel. If you want to know how to tell if cards are real, real or fake, you can go check that channel, that uh, video out. So, but yeah, I've made a video on it. Ooh, a couple rare Lugias I've seen. See, that's authentic because it doesn't have that weird feeling to it and that weird uh, hollow print to it. Energies, a couple more rare Lugias. Reverse hollow. So, but yeah, definitely get your money's worth. I uh, also have a video on how the process I go through on checking out deals for eBay, how I find these deals and kind of my thought process through it. So I've kind of, I've more or less went through and shown you guys how I go through this whole process of ooh, reverse hollow rare Rhyperior of how I made this series half, how I make the series happen without completely losing a bunch of money. Hollow rare, crab brawler, Basically, what I do is just look at them, take my best guess, and ask, hey, if I were to break this up and sell it, would I make my money back? Most time, it's yes. Snorlax. I mean, I wouldn't actually do it because it would take me forever. A couple different language cards, throw them up there. Charmillions, a couple of them. Quite a few of them, actually. A lot of them. Ooh, Professor's Research, rare card there. So yeah, just in this little bit, these are all the rares, reverse hollows, hollow rares, stuff like that, that we've gotten. Kind of trying to keep them a little bit sorted for you guys so we can take a better look at them at the end. Burn Pod, Togedomaru, Krogonk, Panseer, Magikarp, Energies, Hollow, reverse hollow, Corsa, Rare language card, another language, different language. Ooh, Deoxys. A rare Deoxys card. Sableye, more Sableye. Switch, switch. Tool Scraper. I did have to move these into a different box because the other box broke on me. But still, I didn't look, I, you know, I didn't take the time to look through any of these while I was doing that. I just grabbed them stack by stack and moved them to a better... A box that wasn't completely tearing up. Yeah, we got another rare professor's research. Another one, another one. Crab Brawler, Crab Bombadil. That's a rare card. Reverse Hollow. Another rare, Mars Shadow. Galarian Corsola. All right, so these are from Detective Pikachu. We got Licky Tongue, Charmander, Snubble, Magikarp, which all of the, the entire set of this was rare card. Not rare, uh, holographic. So, more of these, more of these, more of these, more of these. Ooh, 2006 Aerodactyl. That's pretty cool. It was an uncommon back then, but that is, look at that cool, that is a cool looking card. 
from the Delta Species set. It says it right there. Delta Species set. Not in the worst condition ever. More Magikarp. Ooh. Pokemon League. Is this like a promo card or something? I don't know. The Reverse Hollow Rare. That's pretty cool. Alrighty, we got some more here. Politoed, Poly... No, that's... That's Lotad. Lombre. Bunch of them. Ooh. Got a reverse hollow one. Roselia, Roselia. Couple rare Rose Roserites. All these are rare. Same card. Limpod. Reverse hollow. We got Scyther. Different Scyther. More Scythers. Deerling. Among Us is that's a rare card. That's from uh Unified Minds. So but yeah, these ones that have that rare hollow like that are fake cards. See? That's how I know it's fake. Cause it's like laminated silicone on it. And they just here's that two of these. See how that one he rips? And that one doesn't. It's another way to tell if they're fake. But we'll throw that up there. I don't care to rip those ones because I have, you know, one, I have multiple of them. So. Call it. Oh, Golurk. That's rare. Ooh, 2007 Mr. Mine. Not sure what set that's from. Not in. I mean, it's got some whiting, but. Definitely not in the worst condition ever. I'm thinking about also making, uh, getting a bunch of cards gathered up that I want to get graded, some older ones, and sending them off to get graded. If you guys would like me to make a video on that, let me know down in the comment section. I'm thinking about sending like 10 or 15 different cards down to get graded. And what I'll do is I will, if you guys want to see it, what I'll do is I will make a list of cards I want to send, and then I will let you guys vote on the ones I should. I'll make like a list of like 20 or 30 different cards I want to send and then let you guys pick the top 10 or whatever. It's another fake card that we send down there. More in a different language. More from 2020. Not sure exactly what set this is from. Maybe Vivid Voltage. And we got more. Oh, well, starting off with a reverse hollow, hollow rare, different language card. We just got three of those. We'll throw them up there. Another reverse hollow. And a couple different Gastly's in a different language. Oh, 2010 Gastly. That one's not in that great of shape. You can see a bunch of scratching on it. Evolutions Gastly's. Got a bunch of them. Haunter, a couple Haunter, more Haunters, different language, different language, Rocky Helmet, uh, again, I think this is from Vivid Voltage, Reverse Hollow, Evolutions, more of these trainer cards, a bunch of these trainer cards, holy crud, hey, we got a Reverse Hollow uh, Choice Man, and then the Reverse Hollow Hex Maniac, Maniac. Bunch of these. Milo and Lana. Reverse Hollow Team Yellow Grunt. Nessa. Again, I don't know what set that's from. That's going to bother me. Bunch of Sonyas. Too bad these aren't the uh, hyper rare Sonyas. Choodle. 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 So many Choodles. Alright, we're going to go through a few more of these. Another Choodle. Ooh, a Dreadnought. A couple of them, actually. Energy. And... That's just a big stack of energies. Gabite from Unified Minds. Another Gabite from Unified Minds. Unified Minds. Gastrodon. Gastrodon. Solrock. Meditite, Meditite, Meditite. Different Meditite. 
That Weedle looks plastic. That definitely looks like a toy. Like they took a toy outside. Because the, the leaves look real. But the Weedle looks like a plastic toy. It looks like they just took a plastic toy outside, set it down, and took a picture of it. And that was the artwork design. Evolutions. I love Evolutions. Definitely my one of my favorite sets. It's probably my favorite newer modern set. Obviously base set being my favorite. It just brings back so many nostalgic memories. But that is probably definitely my favorite. Verse Hollow. A couple of Kakunas from a newer set. Beedrill. Ooh, we just got a bunch of Evolutions Beedrill. So all of those are rare. Beedrill. 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 This is from Champion's Path. I know that much. These are all from... Cha those are from Champion's Path. They weren't rare. These Beedrills are rare. It's amazing how from one set to another, the same Pokemon can either be rare or not rare. Deerling. And then a couple of reverse hollows. Alrighty, I'm gonna get this is gonna be the last stack of them today, guys. We'll have to it's definitely gonna be more than a it was definitely long more than I thought. So the series is gonna definitely gonna be longer than I did. But we're we're what we'll do is we'll do like one week of this and then a week of something else and then go back and forth so it's not all the same thing. A rare, hollow rare Genesect. Every time I see the holographic around here, I'm just hoping maybe one ultra rare or something slip through. But so far, unlucky. Yampers. Ooh, Blitzel. Rhyhorn. Claydol. Claydol. Oh, sorry, that's Boltoy. I don't know why I kept saying Claydol. Mighty Anna. Rhyhorn. Bunch of Rhyhorns. Ooh, okay, so that's from Team Magma. Set 2004. Nah, I still got some whiting around the edges, but it's still pretty cool. I don't think I have this in my collection yet. Put that up there. It's just a different language card. Reverse Hollow. Rufflet. Sorry, Rock Ruff. One of my favorite Pokemon from Sun and Moon. Actually, my favorite. That and Lycan Rock is my favorite. From Sun and Moon. Another Reverse Hollow. Wishmer. Hey, another Lugia. 2009. I uh, don't remember what set this from. I don't know if I have this, but it, that looks like clay. Looks like they took a picture of clay. Move those there. Chin Chow, Chin Chow, Chin Chow. More of those. Hey, another Energy. Chin Chow. More Chin Chows. Hey, we got a Lantern. Reverse Hollow Rare Lantern. Electrike. More Electrikes. A bunch of Electrikes. Anybody need an Electrike? And more Energies. So, we definitely... Okay, so out of this, we didn't do too bad. This is the Energies. A lot of times, you'll get, like, a lot more Energies than you will better cards. But that's the Energies. So, not too bad. This is all... Anything that is a hollow, a reverse hollow up. That is quite a big stack of them. And these are the cards that we got that were pre-2010. 2010 and older. So we got quite a few of those as well. We got more of those. We got about the same amount of energies as we did those. So, but if you guys did enjoy today's episode and enjoy this series... Definitely let me know down in the comment section below, and I will continue to do it. But with that being said, guys, have a great day, and as always, stay safe.